Hello, my Biblio darlings. It's so good to see you. My name is Mally, and you've tuned into Bibliothesia. The story that we're reading today is called When We Are Kind. It's such a beautiful story. But before we read When We Are Kind, let's, let's be kind to our bodies and let's help the body relax. And how are we going to do that? Through jokes. So I'm going to pick up my joke book. And here are some jokes for you. Why was the lightning bug sad? Because her kids weren't too bright. <laughs> okay. Here's the next one. What did one flea say to the other? Shall we walk or take the dog? How many insects does it take to fill an apartment? 10 ants. Get it? Tenants? <laughs> okay. And here's the, the last uh, joke. What did the termite say when he, when he walked into the saloon? Is the bar tender here? <laughs> Get it? Like a bar is wood. And so the termite would say, is it tender? So they can eat at it. <laughs> they can eat. All right. So... I'm hoping you're laughing and those made me go, made, made you go, ha <laughs> ha They did for me. Alrighty. So let's, so let's read When We Are Kind. And the cover is beautiful. It looks like there's two women on the cover. And there's one, two, three, four, five children and a dog. So let's open the book. And it says When We Are Kind and the author is Monique Gray Smith, and it's illustrated by Nicole Neidhart. And I just want to share that if I've said your names incorrect, if we ever meet in person, please come and gently remind me or just share with me how your name is pronounced. Alrighty, so here we go with the story. I am kind when I help my family. I am kind when I share with my friends. Do you share with your friends? Do you help with your family? I am kind when I take my dog for an extra long walk. Do you have a dog? Do you take the dog for an extra long walk? Hmm. I am kind when I help my neighbor. Do you help your neighbor or a person that you see that needs help? I am kind when I bring food to my elders. I'm hoping you bring food to your elders because that is a big sign of respect that you love your elders and that they are really wise. I am kind when I only take from the earth what I need. I'm hoping you only take from the earth what you need. <laughs> do you do that? I'm nodding my head. I am, <clears throat> pardon me. I am kind when I take care of myself and get a good night's sleep. I'm hoping you take good care of yourself and get a good night's sleep. Because sleep is so important for good health. I feel joy when my family and I are kind. Do you feel joy when, you're, when, you, are, when you and your family are kind with one another? Yeah, can I share you in on a little secret? Me too. When my family is kind and there's space to talk in a good way, in a safe way, where everyone's voice is heard, I feel great joy when that happens. Because that's so very special to be heard and seen and feel respected and to know that you matter now, even though you might have differences of opinions. But it's really important to respect 
what people have to say, even if you disagree with them. I feel happy when my friend is kind to me. Yes. Do you feel happy when your friend is kind to you? I feel comforted when my cat is kind to me. Do you feel comforted when your cat is, is kind to you? I'm wondering if that also applies to dogs. I feel comforted when my dog is kind to me. Oh, I do. I feel loved when my elders are kind to me. Do you feel loved when your elders are kind to you? I feel grateful when the earth is kind to me. Do you feel grateful when the earth is kind to you? I feel respectful when I'm kind to myself. So here, I'm thinking of two questions. Are you kind to yourself? And if not, how come? And do you respect yourself? And if not, how come? Because sometimes, I'm, I'm hoping this is okay that I share, but sometimes how we speak to ourselves, and I know that this is true for me, how I've spoken to myself in the past, I've been so incredibly mean to me. And if I heard someone else speak with another person the way that I, in the past, used to speak with myself, I get really upset. So once again, going back to this page, I feel respectful when I'm kind to myself. Yes. When we are kind, we remember we are all related. Very true. Let me say that this again because I think it's very important. When we are kind, we remember we are all related. What did you think of that story? Oh, in the back it says, what does kindness mean to you? Oops. So let me ask you the question, what does kindness mean to you? Does it mean that you respect yourself? Does it mean that you are kind to yourself? Does it mean, oh, pardon me, do you respect when you burp like I just did? Does it mean that you're kind, that you respect the people around you? And let me be very clear. Being kind and respectful doesn't mean that someone else has is given permission to hurt you. That's not what being kind and respectful means. Being kind and respectful means that you respect your body and that you are never to get hurt. And if you get hurt, go find a trusted adult to speak with so that you can be treated with kindness and respect. Very important. Make sure the person is a trusted adult. And then this way, you can be with, a, with people like here, when we are kind. So with that, let's be kind to our bodies and do a deep breathing exercise. And what it means is we're going to inhale for four counts, hold the breath for four counts, and exhale out for eight counts. So are you ready? Let's inhale deeply for one, two, three, four, and now hold the breath for mmm, 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 and now exhale out for eight like you're blowing out wind. Oh, well, I'm hoping you're feeling more relaxed by laughing at the jokes, hearing the story when we are kind, and by doing the deep breathing exercise. Thank you so much for joining in hearing the story and for doing all the deep breathing exercise and the laughing at the jokes and hearing the story, but mostly for taking time out of your busy day to come and join in our time together. Well, it's been so wonderful spending time with you. And until next time, take good care of you. Goodbye.